What do you think about this setup? Hello, my name is Michelle, but you can call me Mimi and I am going to prepare my lunch with you today. We are going to eat rice paper roll. For this, you will need a few ingredients. First, you will need rice papers. Looks like this. It's some kind of Vietnamese product. Next, you will need some carrots. I steamed it for a little bit so it's not too hard. And I have some hot boiling water over here. I'm not going to show that to you. You know what boiling water looks like, right? And then I have some rice vermicelli. I already cooked it once, but because it's in the fridge, it's cold now and a little bit hard. I am going to put it back into the hot water to let it, you know, heat up a bit. Next, we're going to need red pepper, capsicum, bell pepper. I never know what this is called. Oh, I need a knife. Wait a minute. Ah. Last ingredient, you know, for the roll is an avocado. Okay, let's chop this up. are too big so I'm gonna chop this in half each one of them carrots chopped on to my favorite part avocado oh yeah all you have to do is put your knife in it and slice it up slices and then you use a spoon and you just spoon it up. Oh yes. Avocado chopped. And if you want to pit it, you just put your knife into it, twist. Sometimes it doesn't work. <laughs> put your knife into it and twist and then you get it out. Okay, now that everything is chopped, we're going to take out the rice vermicelli and put it on this plate. Is it hot? Ah! And now we're going on to blah, 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 the rice paper part. It looks like this, very thin and it makes this sound. And then you just put it into this hot water, um, slightly cooled. I've put it on top of my working surface. And then I am going to start to assemble it. A few slices of the red pepper, a few slices of carrots, and a few slices of the avocado. And then a tiny bit or a lot bit rice vermicelli. <laughs> and now we roll. So what is my technique? So this part closest to you, fold it, the part away from you, fold it, and then you twist your entire body, this part, roll it over, and then you squeeze everything together and roll, 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 roll. and then you get this. Ah! That's fast forward and let me make more, make more, make more. Done. Did you know that growing up, rice vermicelli soup is my favorite soup? And I know why because my mom told me that when she was pregnant with me, she ate a lot of rice vermicelli soup. You can't blame me for craving rice vermicelli. Ta da! It's done. Oh, oh no, there's a little hole in here. Yeah, okay, I'm back with a water cooker. Here are my rice vermicelli. And you may think, hmm, looks so healthy and it feels like it's not gonna taste like much. So that's why. We're gonna make sauce. We're going 
to make a peanut sauce. Peanut sauce. It's just so good. Peanut sauce. So, I don't have a specific recipe for this. I'm just going to guesstimate everything. So, uh, about one heaping tablespoon of all natural peanut butter. And then, we're going to add about that much of soy sauce. This is rice syrup. Oh my goodness. to go back to your position hmm. yeah because this mixture is too thick it looks like this right now can you see it no whatever you don't have to see it I'm going to add some hot water thin it out that much I think I'm just going to mix it tiny bit more water I think. yeah that's what I'm talking about. Can you see it? Can you see this? Oh. I forgot one thing. Um, because I like my food spicy, I'm going to add this sauce. It's a vinegared Korean chili sauce. And I'm going to add this sauce. Teeny tiny bit. Mix, 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 mix. So that's it. I can finally eat. Hey, let me clean this up. <sighs> I basically just put everything there, but you can't see it. Don't look at it. What I'm going to do is dip this in here. Mm. Oh yes. It tastes, you know, fresh and healthy but still so flavorful at the same time because you have some ooey gooey creamy sauce peanut sauce then I have some fried onions for a bit of crunch here so easy and so delicious hmm what if I cut it in half what would it look like wow it looks good <laughs> Oops, I'm so sorry. Oh no, this one has a hole. I take really big bites, right? I know. <laughs> Last little piece. Okay, I finished everything and it was very delicious. So I hope you make it too. It's so easy and so quick to make and so delicious and so healthy for you uh, ooh, ooh, I am so sorry but I'm Asian and burping means burping is a compliment in my culture so yeah I can do it <laughs> I hope you like this video give me a thumbs up if you like it it makes me happy and subscribe for more videos and I will see you next time it's chopped, carrots chopped, avocado chopped. <laughs>